What an incredible view. Hello and welcome to our extra Saturday review here at Montalegre in Portugal. Uh, two of the main contenders are with us, Toby Haken and, and Timmy Hansen. Uh, it, it, it's been extraordinary days racing today. We've seen lap records smashed. We've seen some good action. From your perspective, Toppy, what's your day been like? Yeah, for us it was a bit uh, complicated day. We didn't find the pace. So we didn't. We, we thought the track improving a bit faster than mm -hmm. it did. So maybe that's why we need to have some work to do for tomorrow. Okay, and Timmy? I think the day started very well. In practice, our pace was very good. I was just behind Peter and, and Johan. Uh, starts have been good, but I think I was just on the wrong side of the grid in Q1. So I didn't have the best day. I'm 11th right now. But I believe the Peugeot is fast and uh, we can definitely turn this around. <laughs> well, um, you guys uh, had some excellent racing today. Is one of the talking points of the day. So I think if we have a little look uh, at what happened. Yeah, we're going to have a look at this. So, Timmy, this was actually, we did a track walk, me and your brother, Kevin, of course, and he said there was one specific place on this track you can overtake. Here you are, up behind Toppy, and talk us through your pass here. I was actually trying to get up the inside in the middle of the hairpin, but then I was so close at this moment, and I thought of Kevin, and I made kind of this carting move, like just to break <laughs> later on the inside. Something flew up. What was that? Somebody's wing mirror? Was that your wing mirror, Toppy? I saw something disappear off. No, Audi never broke down at all. <laughs> <laughs> Audi is indestructible yeah, wing yeah, mirrors. Yeah. Here's another look at it in slow motion. So, Timmy, really, really tight. Toppy, for you, I mean, obviously it was a firm move, but it was, it, you'd be proud of that as well, wouldn't you? Yeah, you know, the payback time coming later. So <laughs> <yeah>. <laughs> Tomorrow we are at the same heat again. No, yeah. no, no, this part of the part of the racing and... Uh, yeah, you know, this this rallycross. It, it's good to see that you guys can pass too, because obviously a lot of this comes down to joke lap tactics, and then people are like, oh, there's no overtaking, but there is overtaking, and, and, and that's a good example of it. On a circuit where a lot of people think maybe you can't. I think I, I was so close for so long. I think you must have had an issue with your car or some, some issue. Usually it's good to stay behind you, uh, but I was so close for a long time, and to do that kind of pass, you really need to be on the bumper, and that's closer to what's normal, I would say. So uh, I... Yeah, and, and I may, made the pass. It's, it's tight, but I thought of Kevin in, in that moment. Uh, I'm, sure, I'm sure Toppy will be thinking of Kevin when he uh, smashes back past you tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> and did you hear that? He said it's good to stay behind you, so just make sure you keep him behind you tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, and tomorrow I'm starting on the fifth lane, and you're starting on the third lane, so... Maybe we can meet up to meet up again. <laughs> <laughs> See you in the Joker. <laughs> <laughs> well, that is something to look forward to. So thanks very much. Join us tomorrow for more R Extra.